All right, guys, so here we go again. We are going to pick up a new critter today. Super excited. The wife might divorce me over this, but going to pick up a new spider today. We are picking up a hair, uh, curly hair tarantula, and I'm beyond the point of excited. I've been trying to get it for, what, a couple weeks now, but the wife's not happy. She does not like spiders. So there's a possibility DSB animals might be divorced after the end of this. But I gotta have this spider. I'm so excited. I'm not a snake guy. I'm a spider guy. So, we're on the way to pick up the curly hair tarantula. Once we get them, we'll show you and then we'll go from there. Sounds like a plan. I already got the tank ready too. The tank's been ready for a week and a half. But we're heading to the pet store. Gonna pick it up and then we'll go from there. All right, guys, we're at two days later now. Um, our spider journey didn't go so hot. They sold out. So, yeah. But they're supposed to get more back on Thursday. So, Thursday we will get Hodor. And I am ready. And, yes, I've already named him Hodor. But, anyways, uh, got some new friends here. Got three new Chinese algae eaters and a common Playco. Because the 35 gallon or 45 gallon or whatever it is, it's starting to get some algae in it. So, uh, good time to get these guys. It's had time to cycle and do its thing. So, yeah, let's get them acclimated. And on these guys, we're just going to float them. I'm not going to worry about bucket and drip acclimate, drip acclimating and all that stuff. We're just going to float these guys. But you can see the stuff I've got going on, the leaves and everything, which is not bad yet. It's definitely cleanable. But why not go ahead and get these guys in there and add some new fishies to the tank, which is looking great, by the way. My goodness, looking beautiful. Batman and Fred are still doing great. Which Batman and Fred will go back in the turtle pond. Where is Batman? Oh, there's Batman. So I'm hanging down out here at the bottom. So, or unless they like it in here and I like them in here, we might just go for that. I don't know yet, but we're gonna give these guys about 30 minutes, 45 minutes, and we'll see. We'll let them go and see how they do. All right, let's see if we can get them in this net without pouring them in the bucket. Or see if we can get them out. Because <laughs> they are sucker fish. Come on, baby. I don't want to have to hurt, hurt you now. There you go. Anyways, easiest way to do it. Net, bucket, fish. Good to go. Alright. And then... We just let them go. Come on out, little guys. There they go. Play goes straight to the bottom, straight on the glass. Got one little guy back there. I just seen another one swim off. But yeah. Oh, there's one. So there's one, there's two, common Playco, doing his thing sucking on the glass, and the third one went back here somewhere, there he is, right there underneath Batman in the wood. So cool, we'll see how they do, we'll throw a wafer in there for them, and go from there but they're little guys but they will grow and those little guys are the same as this guy oh effer hey goblin king yeah i don't know if i can see the reverse flash right now no you can't he's inside there but he's my golden chinese algae eater 
And then Faze and Rug, they were just in here a minute ago. If I, if I see them come out, we'll get a, get a clip of them, but I've got a whole bunch of these guys, but they're just neat. They're good little fish to have and they clean everything. So, yeah, hopefully we'll get a shot of the reverse flash coming out and all that green on the tanks, that damn uh, Java fern root is just going crazy. Finger. And this is gonna be Hodor's tank. Hide, something to climb on, something to play on, water dish. Just a good five gallon tank, perfect for a spider. And I like the background too, so I think it worked out really well. But I think we're gonna do this one we're gonna take one of these down, put it somewhere else, and put another five gallon tank up here. Cause I've got room for two five gallon tanks, plus one of them, and do another tarantula. So, not a spider shelf or anything for no reason. All right, everybody, it's finally Thursday. I know this video is taking days and days and days to do but I just got a message from a pet store lady. Hodor is there and she's holding them for me. She's trying not to burp, but it burped anyways. But anyways, super excited, done for the day, out here playing in the middle of the mesquite trees in the oil field and doing my thing. We're gonna go pick up Hodor right now. See y'all when we pick him up. Too excited, guys. Look at this beauty. Oh my goodness. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Absolutely beautiful. But he's been through enough right now. We're gonna get him home, get him in his tank and get him all set up. But my goodness, absolutely beautiful. And we'll be able to get uh, better footage of him at the house without all these water spots and stuff. But I am so excited and they said he just ate. So pretty cool stuff, guys. Wow, I am so excited. I'm sorry, honey. All right, guys, we're home. We're gonna wait for a second. One, to kind of let him calm down a little bit because it's kind of a bumpy ride, which I held him as best as I could. And two, I got a friend coming over that wants to see him. So we don't have cool pet stores around here. All we have is the big box pet store. So that's why I pay a little extra. I know I could go online, but I ain't the smartest when it comes to online. and all that fun stuff, but yeah, I'm super excited and I think it's worth the money. He is too cool, guys. But once my buddy gets over here, let let him check him out, we'll get him in the tank and show you in his tank. All right, well, he finally came out. It's been a couple hours later, done had dinner and everything. He was, trying to hide in that little corner right there. It's an old sea urchin fossil. But then he finally found his hide and now he's coming out to, to visit. So we're gonna let him chill. I added another piece of a hide that I cut a long time ago to kind of make it look more like a house and a little deeper for him. But we're gonna let him hang out and chill. We're gonna check on him tomorrow, see how it's going. And like I said, guys, I'm beyond the point of excited. Look, all the crickets are huddled up top. They're like, oh, damn, we own a spider's tank. But those are the crickets that came with him, so I went ahead and just put them in there. But if they're not eating tomorrow, I'll probably take them out. But anyways, let's check back tomorrow. 
All right, we're at 24 hours later. I think he's finally starting to get a little comfortable. But he seems to really enjoy his hide. Really hasn't left the hide. I'd really like it. I would really like to see him out and about running around, but but if he wants water, he's got to come over here. But anyways, guys, super excited. I know it took a week, but we got him. And I am just enamored with him. I think he's so damn beautiful. But this is Hodor. And look, he's holding the door. <laughs> anyways, guys, we'll drop it here. We'll leave it here. Sea Archer and Fossil is still pretty cool. But... I'm in love with this Hodor. He is so beautiful. And like I always say, until next time.